Okay, I'm going to show you guys exactly what I'm using. Got these Owner Mosquito Light Size 1 hooks. That's usually what I like throwing out there on the drop shot, just nose hooking it like you guys seen on my other videos. But today I got the Gamugatsu Offset Shank Worm EWG 3 aught hooks. That's what I'm going to be tying on today. I'm going to be tying on the Finesse Worm. I'm going to be Texas rigging it. I'm going to show you guys that real quick. And I got the 1 4th ounce tear shot drop shot weight. I'll show you guys real quick. Before we head out there, I'm going to show you guys how I'm tying the drop shot. Grab your tag in. Bring it through the eye of the hook like that. I like to measure out about a foot, foot and a half from where your weight's going to be. You can grab your... Uh, Middle finger, put it around the eye of the hook. Bring your tag in up the main line about six, seven times. Just like that. And then where you're holding your finger on that hole, bring your tag in back through there like that. And then just wet your line up. And then cinch it down just like that one of the important things you're going to want to do right after that is bring your tag in right back to the eye of the hook like that and then bring it back down and that's what that's going to do is going to let your hook sit up like that so you have a better presentation and you can set the hook better so standing straight up like that on your line. All right, now we're gonna tie on the the weight. So to put on the weight real quick, I just make a little simple knot. Just pass the line over a few times, about four or five times, and then just tying a simple knot like that. That's where your drop shot weight's gonna go on to. You could tie a few up your line, tie a few of them, so you can have different uh, depths. And uh, what I like about the drop shot weight, use that tear shot, that you just pass it. Bring your tag in through there and then pass it right up the little knot you made. All you're gonna do is cinch it up and just pull it up. There we go. We go we have the drop shot tight on got your hook up here and then about a foot and a half liter and your weight down here okay now this is a finesse worm that I made it's a 4.75 inches and then what you're gonna want to do is bring your hook and then barely pierce it to where it bends right there and then poke it out and then bring it up the shank of the hook Flip it around, flip your worm around so it sits up like that on the shank. And then to measure this out, just see where it's going to sit like that. And then you can bend it back, pierce it through, just like that. Make it weedless a little bit, tuck in the hook. And there you go, we got the drop shot tied on. Texas rig the worm and then about a foot and a half liter you got your one fourth ounce tear shot drop shot weight now we're ready to catch some fish and that's how I'm doing it let's get out there you guys so we're out here at the california aqueduct and we're trying to show you guys how to locate bass and catch them let's start by showing you how to locate them all right now let's catch them all right here we go got one of my worms try these bad boys to see where it's gonna fit you can bend it in and then uh, I've been exposing the hook so I can set the hook better because 
hasn't been working for me when I uh, bury it in. I'm not that good at setting the hook yet, so we're gonna leave the hook exposed like that. Just like that. Let's get in there. And then I got my uh, Abu Garcia Max XTX paired with some uh, six pound fluorocarbon. And I got it on the Insight Pro Advantage 7 foot 2 drop shot rod, medium fast action that I got from Walmart. And with the six pound test, seems to be working. Has some, uh, it has a good tip to it, real sensitive, lets me feel the bite a little bit better. So we're gonna give it a go, see if we can get on something. In there. Just kind of aggressively working it. Just trying to get the worm to move around, make it look realistic. just uh, shaking the rod tip giving it little shakes trying to entice something to come up and bite it every now and then I let it go down let it slack let it hit the bottom and just pop it and just keep on casting you'll find them Leave it in there, pop it a few times, just shaking it. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, that's a good one. I want to say three pounder. See, on that red worm, you guys. Oh, that's a chunky one. Oh, there you guys go. On that red worm. Oh, that's a nice one. All right, so with this one, I got the drop shot, EWG hook, offset. This is a nice one. You guys see that one? Eat that red worm. Check out them fine line lures. Got these finesse baits for sale. Let's go. Cool. Another 16, 17. Good 17 incher. See how much it weighs real quick. Oh damn, I left the scale over there. All right, here we go. Thank you for the fight. Nice chunky one on my finesse worm. Let's go. Ooh, there it goes. Let's see if we can get on some more. All right, here we go. We're gonna try this one. This is a glow in the dark one I just made. We're just gonna go right down to the tip like that. You could just catch them along, you know, along structure, bridges. I like catching them along here. Sometimes we like to hang out or along the sides, banks. It's just uh, different ways. Just working it aggressively, trying to get some movement out of it.
There we go. Oh, that's a nicer one. Oh no, never mind. There we go. Got one on the blue one, or the June bug. There we go. See if we can get some more. What the fuck? Oh, it came off. Another one that quick. There we go, my finesse worm. Thank you for the fight once again. Let's see if we can get some more. All right, let's see if we can get another one. Even get a real big one. Let's see. Shit, this one's a beast. He just nailed it. Oh shit. There's another carp. Maybe it feels like it. Oh no, it's a big bass. Oh shit. Oh, he almost came off. A chunky one. Oh, it's cool. That's how we're doing it. Oh, that's a nice one. I'll take that any day. You guys see that? On oh, my June bug finesse worm. That's a decent one. Oh shit. That's a nice one. Oh man, thank you for the fight. Let's measure it real quick. Actually, I'm... Oh, 
that's not too big. Three pounds, two pounds? Looks bigger. Another 17 incher. There we go. Let's get him back in the water. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, damn. What is this? Damn, this thing's fighting hard. Damn, it don't feel like a bear. What is this? Striper? Or a bass? A carp? I wonder if it's fighting hard. Got a carp on my on my drop shot worm. There it is on my drop shot worm. Got him. It's a decent sized one. Thought it was a striper or something. Let's go on my worm. There we go. Cool three pounder on the drop shot. See you guys on the next one.